Swine flu is here. H1N1, pig fever, fever, influenza, like the many names of Vishnu. But it is no laughing matter. It's a fatal disease. Enough people have died for the media to create hype about it. And the government is doing nothing. Today to talk with us, we have Mr. K. A. Babu, the General Secretary of the NVMPI. Thank you for being with us, sir. Hello. Now, um, rational and secular people say it's pigs. Um, who do you think is behind swine flu? It's clearly not the pig. And there is, during election time, I believe, a direct conspiracy to appease a certain minority by certain parties. What are you talking about? I mean, look at it. Pig flu, pigs are evil, swine flu, swine are evil. It's pretty obvious who I'm talking about here. Could you elaborate? Look, we are 92.2% in the south. We are the majority. In the north, we are only 40%, but overall, we are still the majority. 62.2%. But now, a certain party or even many, many parties are trying to get votes from this particular minority, which is trying to turn us into them. This is clearly vote bank politics, and they are trying to bank on their votes. You know who I'm talking about. Um, I don't want to deviate from swine flu. That is what we're talking about. Today. But you know who I'm talking about. Who are you talking about? The vegetarians. It's a clear-cut conspiracy. First it was mad cow, so we stopped eating mad cows. Then they said AIDS came from monkeys, so we stopped eating monkeys. After it was chicken gunya and bird flu, so we stopped eating chicken and birds. This time it's swine flu. It's the vegetarians. Mindry.in was not able to verify any of the allegations made by Mr. K. Babu, the General Secretary of the Non-Vegetarian Meat-Eating Party of India. The youth icon of the vegetarians, six-year-old Satish, had this to say over the phone. His name sounds like Kababu. He's also ugly. Why doesn't he have any hair? Is he a doctor? 